Hello traders. Welcome to the Smart Algo YouTube channel. Today we have something really special to share with you, which is an in-depth guide on how to use our Smart Algo indicators. This is going to take your trading to the next level, so let's jump right in. Our indicators are designed to simplify your trading experience while maximizing profitability. They tell you when to buy and sell, when to take profit, and where to put the stop loss. And today, we're going to show you how to make the most of these features. First off, go on Trading View and click on Indicators. Then go to Invite Only Scripts and add our indicators to your chart. Quick side note here, our indicators work with all instruments and candle types such as normal Japanese candlesticks and Heiken Ashi candles, but we recommend using normal candlesticks. On the chart, I have the SPY loaded up on the hourly time frame, as well as the V1 indicator. Our algorithm tell you the optimal times to enter and exit a position. This reduces guesswork and increases accuracy in your trading. The green lines here are take profit suggestions, which guide you on when to lock in your profits. The red line shows you where you could potentially set your stop loss to limit potential losses if the market doesn't move in your favor. Here in the settings of V1, you'll see a wide array of options and features. The first setting is confirmed signals. This is the green or red X on the chart. It appears after a buy or sell signal to confirm the entry. This type of signal would be considered less risky, but it does not always appear. For example, the two trades on the left have confirmed signals, but the one of the right does not. If you chose to only enter on confirmed signals, then you may possibly lose out on some profit, but also decrease your losses. Confirmed signals can be toggled on or off. Next, we have trend bar color. When we have a buy or sell signal, the signal candle will turn green or red on candle close. This helps traders identify which candle the signal appeared. Next, we have the filters. The RSI and moving average filters work to filter out high-risk signals that occur at unideal areas in price action and to protect against choppiness in the markets. These filters can be turned on or off. The X-bar range input limits the repeated signals you see within a specific number of bars. It helps to keep your chart clean and easy to read. We recommend to leave this on. Next is the dynamic support and resistance filter. This tool helps you avoid buying or selling when prices are near support or resistance areas. Just a note, if you turn off this filter, you'll see more trades, but more isn't always better in trading. Then we have the take profit and stop loss settings. You can change the distance of these values by adjusting the multiplier. Keep in mind that due to hedging mode, changing the multiplier will lead to different signals on the chart. The hedging mode option is designed to work in our favor even when market trends take an unexpected turn. By giving us a signal in the opposite direction, it enables us to capture a reversal, aligning us with the broader market trend. Now I will showcase a brief backtest of the V1 indicator in action on the SPI chart using the most recent data. In ranging markets, we might face some losses, and that's a part of trading. But here's the good news. Our system boasts a high risk to reward ratio that can lead to substantial returns over time. Also, it's a smart move to have a break-even system in place. One strategy could be adjusting your stop loss to break even once the trade has hit a one-to-one -one ratio. It's all about managing risks and maximizing profits in the long run. Remember, the take profit and stop loss lines we discuss are meant to serve as guides, not hard and fast rules. They're tools to help you make informed decisions, but always take them in context of your overall trading strategy and market conditions. In the second part of our video, we will dive deeper into the specifics of the Smart Algo Reversal Indicator. This tool is designed to help you identify key reversal points in the market. By doing so, it provides you with a clear advantage in foreseeing potential trend changes. Regardless of the instrument or time frame you are trading, the Smart Algo Reversal Indicator has been developed to work seamlessly. The Reversal Indicator is based on complex algorithms that analyze multiple technical factors in real time, such as price action, volume, and momentum. When these factors converge and the algorithm determines that a trend reversal is likely, it alerts the trader with a visual signal on the chart. 
The reversal indicator does not create signals just based on the upper and lower bands. The upper and lower bands are areas where a reversal could take place, but several other criteria must be met before a signal is generated. But there's more to the smart algo reversal indicator. Besides spotting reversals, it offers more functionality to make your trading process easier and more profitable. The indicator provides clear and timely buy and sell signals, reducing the guesswork and emotional decision-making often associated with trading. But these signals are not just for entering trades. You can also use the reversal signals as exit points for your trades, enabling you to fully capitalize on the market's movement from edge to edge. The Smart Algo Reversal Indicator suggests optimal take profit and stop loss levels. These are calculated by the algorithm, considering factors such as volatility and historical price action, helping to maximize your profits and limit potential losses. As always, you should think of this as a guideline in helping you make your trading decisions. Remember, the Smart Algo Reversal Indicator is designed to help you identify potential reversals, providing buy and sell signals, and suggesting take profit and stop loss levels. The green dots typically indicate potential bullish reversals within a downtrend or pullbacks within an overall uptrend. These points suggest that there is a possibility of the market shifting from a downward direction to an upward direction or experiencing a temporary pause before continuing its upward movement. On the other hand, the red dots represent potential bearish reversals within an uptrend or pullbacks within an overall downtrend. These points suggest that there is a potential shift from an upward direction to a downward direction or a temporary pause before resuming the downward movement. It's important to note that these dots act as visual indicators of possible reversals, serving as a guide to potential trading opportunities. Let's break down the input settings for the reversal indicator, which allows you to customize the tool to your trading strategy and risk tolerance. The signal type input controls the frequency of signal generation. With every signal, generates a signal at each potential reversal point, resulting in a higher number of signals. This setting suits capturing shorter term or minor price movements within a trend. However, not all signals may indicate significant trend changes, so market context and risk management are important considerations. Alternatively, one signal, the indicator generates a single signal per trend, focusing on strong potential reversal points and reducing overall signals. This selective approach is useful for capturing significant trend changes in strong trending markets. Next, we have the buy and sell bands. Band levels range from 1 to 3 for both buy and sell signals, and they correspond to the colors on the bands. A higher band level means stricter criteria for generating signals, resulting in fewer signals but with a higher likelihood of success. For example, changing the band level value from 1 to 2 will reduce the number of signals as the algorithm looks for potential reversals deeper into the pullback. Sensitivity. This setting affects the stringency of the criteria when scanning for reversal signals. A higher sensitivity means stricter conditions for generating signals. We recommend a value between 2 and 4, depending on the time frame you're trading. Neutral sensitivity. This setting controls the minimum distance between consecutive signals, or in other words, how soon a new signal can be generated after the previous one. We've found that a value of 30 is typically optimal for most time frames, but it can vary based on the particular characteristics of the time frame you're trading. Interior signal. This is a filter designed to ensure that a signal is generated on the candlestick that has a higher probability of being the point of reversal. Take profit and stop loss settings. These settings are fully customizable, allowing you to set the take profit and stop loss levels that best align with your risk management strategy and profit targets. By adjusting these settings, you can tailor the smart algo reversal indicator to your own trading style and market conditions. Always remember to thoroughly understand the methodology and guidelines of the Smart Algo Reversal Indicator and conduct thorough testing to ensure its suitability for your trading style and preferences. That wraps up our comprehensive guide on using our Smart Algo Indicators. We hope that you now feel more confident in using these tools to enhance your trading decisions. To get started, visit smartalgo.com or click the first link in the description. If you found this guide helpful, do us a favor and hit the thumbs up button.
Your feedback means a lot to us. And share this video with your fellow traders who could benefit from this information. To stay updated on insightful tips and tutorials, make sure you subscribe to our channel. We have a wealth of knowledge to share with you, and we wouldn't want you to miss out. Thanks for watching.